a uh, Ontario manufacturer of uh, dispensing and feeding equipment, uh, more specifically uh, friction feeders, trade and esters, and uh, custom automation. Uh, Schneider Electric's a uh, solution provider in the electrical field. We're also an energy efficiency specialist globally, and uh, working with David, um, we uh, sell some products and solutions that uh, are used on his equipment. We've been very successful with Snyder throughout the, uh, the last three years, and we've actually built that relationship um, uh, even further in the last six months by introducing an open source uh, platform on all our friction feeders where we're going to use a Snyder PLC uh, touchscreen controller. I'm pretty excited that we've taken, uh, uh, helped Dave take the machine to the next level by by reducing the overall number of components on the machine. Here we have our new generation of machine working with Dave McCharles at Pinebury and his mechanical and electrical programmers. So far fewer connections. We've eliminated uh, at least six connections going from the combination HMI PLC and uh, the power supply, uh, servo control power supply that was previously in a large gray box is now actually incorporated in the integrated servo device. We've helped hopefully reduce the, uh, the wiring of the machine, simplified, compact, uh, cost-effective solution that adds to the performance of the machine. We've gone from a 24 by 24 inch uh, control panel box now to nothing, which has now made our, uh, our friction feeder portable. The controller itself is replacing a proprietary con control board. Here we have our first generation of uh, a feeding system, our uh, control panel, which we've simplified in the new generation. So our control panel has our contr uh, controller, a power supply, uh, the servo uh, amplifier controller module, so all the parameters that uh, might have been only accessible through uh, a PC or a laptop now are displayed on, on, a, on a simplified graphic terminal. It's a smarter machine, but overall it, it's a simpler machine to, uh, to use. You can actually get information from the terminal through an app on, on your iPhone. There's two initiatives that we're doing right now. One is, is um, again, the open source uh, technology. It's the way the future is being built. Our automation is, is allowing um, consumer goods companies to be able to implement these, uh, uh, these our products into their assembly lines to allow them to track and trace their product. So this is the uh, Pineberry flat uh, carton uh, ser serialization uh, system. We're introducing uh, uh, two new systems uh, into the pharmaceutical industry for serialization. We've come up with a solution for flat cartons that will uh, enable small to uh, medium-sized users able to serialize those cartons uh, before they're filled. What it does is essentially allows our customers to uh, load their flat cartons into, uh, into a magazine. We feed them out automatically. We have a domino uh, coding system that will put the uh, 2D barcode and then again a Cognex uh, camera that will verify. For specific machines, we, we have things called TVDAs, Tested, Validated, Documented Architectures. So for a TVDA, we, we, uh, we take multiple products and uh, we, we know that there's typical types of machines out there. So we're, we're you know, with uh, Pineberry's equipment, the TVDA might not be 100% uh, uh, applicable. It could be 90 or 80% applicable. So we take that pre-done application and we would customize and optimize it for, for, uh, for David's machines.